everyone, this is Bharat here. Welcome to Talent Open Studio for Data Integration Training. We are in Module 1 where we are installing all required softwares for talent training. In previous video, we saw how to install Oracle Express Edition database. In this video, we will see how to install SQL Developer. SQL Developer is an IDE for Oracle database. By IDE, I mean Integrated Development Environment. SQL Developer helps you interact with your database in a much better fashion and in a much more user-friendly way than the SQL command line. So let's get started with downloading SQL Developer. For downloading SQL Developer, you need to go to Google, search for the SQL Developer download, and the first link is going to redirect me to Oracle website. So as always, you firstly need to accept the license agreement and then this website will list down all the various versions of SQL Developer. SQL Developer uses Java to interact with the database. So rather than installing JDK separately for SQL Developer, we will download the version of SQL Developer which has JDK inbuilt so that you don't have to install JDK 8 separately. So here we are going to download Windows 64 bit with JDK 8 included version. So you just click on download button and, and as always it is going to ask for to create an account if you already have the account you just sign in with the account and your download will start automatically so I already have downloaded the SQL developer and I have unzipped it you don't need to install SQL developer it's just an application based interface so, so, open to, so to open the SQL developer you just need to click on this application file and your SQL developer will start running. So the first time you will open the SQL developer, your screen will look like this. So you firstly need to create a connection to your Oracle database. So here you need to make sure that your database is running before you make a connection. So we can do that by clicking on start database option in the command line this start database is going to run my database which i have installed in my previous video so now when you see this command prompt like c window system 32 it means your database is running now let's just try to create a connection to this database using sql developer so to create a connection i'm going to click on plus and give some name to the connection so first connection I'm going to make is for the system user so I'm going to name it connection as system admin username as system and password is oracle you can save the password and you can test that as you can see the connection status is success so means I am able to connect to this particular database using system credentials so likewise I am going to create a connection with the user which I have created in the previous video So here again I'm going to repeat the steps which I performed for connecting to Oracle database from system user. But this time my connection name I will put it as my name. You can save the password and once again I will test the connection and the connection is successful. So I will click on connect and my connection has been made to database. Now let's just try to create some sample table using this connection. As of now I can see under the table section there are no any tables created. So let's just try to create some sample table. So here I am going to create a one employee table which has ID and my first name as the two columns. employee ID which is of data type integer and name 
use of data type varchar so to run this query i will just select this query and click on run so as you can see in the console my table employee has been created let's just try to create insert some records into this table So we see one row has been inserted let's just commit it now let's just try to fetch the records which we have recently inserted into the database so we see we are able to fetch the records which we have inserted so that's all from this video in this video we have seen how to install the SQL developer and we see how to create some sample table in the oracle database using SQL developer. In the next video we will see how to use talent and we will see how to create one sample job in talent. Thanks for watching.